There's been like eight boxes of pizza in the studio right now. Ugh. The review embargo has lifted for Nvidia's RTX 2070 graphics card, and the overall story seems to be similar to the 2080. The card is fine, but once again, the lack of RTX and DLSS support in games makes its price hard to justify right now. The price to performance ratio is not super good, and a lack of good competitor cards from AMD means Nvidia can keep charging a lot for these top tier cards. PZ Gamer has a giant headline, reading the new card is 12% faster than the GTX 1080, but costs 33% more. Woo! Yeah. We can't verify those numbers specifically right here on TechLinked, but Anthony and Linus's full review is up on Linus Tech Tips, so check that out at the link in the description. Warning, if you watch it without ray tracing, it might not even be worth it. Might as well be watching on a potato. And how much of your life do you want to spend like that? None, none of it. <laughs> Earlier this year, Google was fined $5 billion by the European Commission for illegally dominating the web search market. The main issue being that while Google offers Android as a free open source operating system, if manufacturers want to include the Google Play Store, they also have to pre-install other Google apps like Search, Chrome, Gmail, and more, while also abiding by certain restrictions. It is good to be the king. <laughs> yes. What is it? Is that a reference it's to a something? from Age of Empires. I. <laughs> you remember you used to be able to press those buttons? I never. I never played Age of Empires. In response to the fine, Google has altered that agreement. Pray they do not alter it further. <laughs> Android will still be free, but if you want any Google apps, you'll need to pay licensing fees, which is how Google is going to make up the ad revenue that they're losing by potentially not having Search and Chrome on Android devices. So we may see companies like Samsung release an Android device in Europe with Bing pre-installed instead of Google Search. <laughs> <laughs> or Chinese Android phone makers launch completely Google-free phones. Wow, Google-free life. <laughs> Can you even imagine such thing? I just... Baidu. Yeah, I well, I prefer Google. Speaking of Chinese phone makers, Huawei has taken the wraps off their new flagship Mate 20 and Mate 20 Pro. While the Mate 20 Pro has a traditional notch, or traditional now, that's kind of sad, the Mate 20 has a single dewdrop camera notch that takes up a tiny portion of the top of the screen. I think the Essential phone also had something like that. That's something I can live with. It's got three cameras on the back, some real fancy internals like a 4,200 milliamp hour battery with the ability to charge other phones wirelessly, and it can use the camera to measure the calories of food? That seems a little fishy. I get it. Fishy? Because fish is food, right? Friends. Sometimes. Oh, fish are friends, not food. Yeah, okay. Huawei also announced the <laughs> NM card, a proprietary format for flash storage the size of a nano SIM card. Not sure we needed an SD card to be only slightly smaller, but hey, Huawei's doing their thing. I don't want to stand in their way. I have to go now. See ya. See you in the next. Oh. Now it's time for Quick Bits, which are brought to you today by Brilliant, the new way to master key concepts in math, science, computer science, and professional topics. Learning from lectures and videos isn't as effective as diving in and doing things yourself. Getting your hands dirty with numbers and ideas, so Brilliant helps you master concepts by solving fun, challenging problems yourself, not by watching someone else do it. Over 5.5 million members are already sharing their curiosity and love for math and science, plus the first 200 TechLink viewers to sign up get 20% off. So head to brilliant.org slash techlinked and sign up today. Quick bits time, go! Let's get it on. <laughs> Discord has launched the beta for their online store, the Discord store what it's called. Its curated selection of games is open to all users, while the Discord Nitro subscription service will have a few extra games included. And you'll also now be able to launch games from other stores through Discord. Better watch your back, Steam. Discord's coming for you. And they got way cooler announcement videos. You should see it. I know you haven't seen it, but it's really great. YouTube, the world's largest video platform, went down for over an hour yesterday leading to panicked users tweeting their horror over being unable to watch their makeup tutorials. Meanwhile, Flowplane users were sitting pretty. <laughs> what a great website. Facebook just launched their portal home video chat devices, but they're reportedly working on even more ways to get a camera into your home with a video chat camera designed to sit on top of a TV in development. They'll get in there, one way or another. They'll get in. The Skydio R1 drone is meant to be controlled via a phone app, but now you can use an Apple Watch, fulfilling your dreams of having a robot sidekick. I mean, I had those dreams. I don't. Did you want a robot killer killer sidekick? The killer, killer, yeah, before. the killer one got him excited. 
And Sega has- Sega! No! Sega! Sega! They've jumped on the classic mini console bandwagon with the release of the Mega SG, which will support Sega Genesis, Mega Drive, and Master System cartridges. Why did they just call it the Mega Sega? I, d Mega Sega, well, SG. Exactly, they're it, so close. They took out the vowels, that's cool now. And you can get adapters also that will play even more types of retro games. Grames, games, grames, anything you wanna play, this thing will do it. Just slice Dyson. Hopefully you're not slicing you your cartridges. Doesn't. Hopefully this Tech Linked episode did it for you. And if not, I guess tech news just isn't your shtick. If it is, we'll be back on Friday. But if it isn't, we won't. But if we are, I guess we'll see you then. But if we don't, we'll see you on another time. You'll be back. They always come back. <laughs>